we are seeing the classification of industries. The next category that is classification on the basis of capital investment. It is very important capital. Without capital, we cannot start any industries though other factors are favorable for you. So, money, capital is very much important. Also, not only initially, but every time, every day, the continuous supply of revenue is important. So, how much money is invested when starting the industries? On that basis, the classification is in which the first category that is large industries. In the large industries, the capital more than 10 crores. Now these large industries like automobile industries uh, in which we require the huge amount initially to set up the industry to purchase the machinery. And so in the industries where the amount is more than 10 crores the industries are known as large industries. The next category that is macro industries. In macro industries, it is not more than 25 lakh. For example, pen or dairy industries. Not all the industries are big. Some are small, some are medium. It is totally depend on the initial amount or collected amount by the person. And so the industries in which the amount is not more than 25 lakh invested while starting the industry that is called macro industry. The next category that is small industry. In the small industries it is not it is more than 25 lakh but not exceed rupees 5 crores. So the amount which is invested in the industry in between 20, 25 lakh and 5 crore that category is come under small industries. The next category that is medium industries. In this category more than 5 crore but not exceed rupees 10 crores. So, in between 5 crore to 10 crore, the investment is done in the industry. That industry is known as medium industry. The example of these industries that is cycle industry, TV industries, radio making industries. These are these some of the consumer products which are demanded and those industries are known as medium industries. The next type in which cottage industries. Cottage industries is also known as household industries. Household In household industries it is the production is done in the house and the family members are working as a labor. All the works is done by manual and so my manual production is the main it is done the production is done locally raw material the example is blacksmith carpenter potter weaver these are the examples they are doing these products at home the raw material which is available nearby the area and they are selling in the region. Nowadays because of communication, transportation and the advertisements as well, the technology is very developed that the information is spread all over the world. People are sitting at one place and they can know about the culture the products in various corners of the world. Same, the some of the cultural products, 
some products which are very much famous or demanded in all over the world. For example, in Maharashtra, Paithani Sari. Paithani Sari is one of the demanded product all over the world. And that Paithani Sari is handmade. These workers take near about month to, to make these saris. Similarly, one of the example like Kashmir, where Pashmina shawls. These shawls are very much demanded in all over the world. So such products which have a quality, which have a different look, different status and they are created, they are made by some people who only they can do it and so they are sell into international market on higher price. So nowadays this cottage industry is also one of the famous and one of the uh, industry in which the labors, the people who are involved in this industry, they are getting good returns. In the next category of classification of industry, it is classification on the basis of ownership. Means who is owning the industry. On that basis, the classification is done in which the first category is public sector. Public sector industries, it means the industries in which the government is involved. The total cost, the total investment, the marketing is done by government. There is no involvement of any individual or any group of people. So total investment, total marketing, production, raw material, cost, import, export, everything is done by government. The example is Bhil, Bharat Heavy Electrical Limited. So this is a public sector industry. The second type of industry that is private sector. In private sector, the private or individual people are involved in the industries in which private partnership is also involved in this category of industry. Example that is Tata Industries or Reliance Industries. So in this the investment, marketing, selling, quality decided that is by the individual or the private partners. There is no involvement of any government. For example, Tata Industries that is well known. Second is Reliance that is also a well known industry. The next type that is joint sector. In joint sector, government as well as individual person or a group of people, they are combinedly running the industry. For example, MNCL, Maharashtra Natural Gas Limited. So in this type joint venture or joint sector, government and public means private or individual or a group of people, they are coming together and combinedly they are uh, doing the work. The next type of industry that is cooperative industry. Cooperative, cooperation. In this type of industry, a group of people of same raw material, same product, they are combinedly come together and they are running the industry. The example is Amul industry. Amul, which is very well known uh, industry, where, which is producing the dairy products, the milk as well as other milk products. 
they are well known as well as demanded the first cooperative type of industry in india it was amul industry there are so many other industry in which profit and losses are shared so whatever production they are taking they are combinedly taking the decisions so either they get profit or they get loss all this is shared among those people and they are running the industry the last type of industry that is mncs multinational cooperation now multinational national nations multi more than two nations more than two nations are coming together and they are running the industries example is ongc oil and natural gas cooperation so the mncs in which the more than two countries are involved in that nowadays we are seeing it industries it industries which are producing softwares as well as hardware and in that multinational companies we always hear uh, hear this um, word and so multinational cooperation is also one of the sector of industries which is on the basis of ownership thank you